Hello everybody, this is Devin Millar. Today, I'm going to show everyone how to change the engine sounds using Frosty Editor. This can be done with any .gin and .tmx file. So for a sample of a project, we are going to be using the Cobalt sound from Most Wanted 05 and putting it on the Polestar in Need for Speed Heat. This can be done for 2015 Payback and Heat, of course. So first, go to your program files and locate the sound. It's called Cavill Level 1, and it's located in Engine, in the JotGin folder inside your program files for Need for Speed Most Wanted 05. So we're going to take this, and we're going to copy and paste it into a new folder. I'm going to put it in the Documents folder. And then we're going to rename the .gin part into .chunk instead. Then open up your heat.exe file in Frosty Editor. Then, once you're in here, go to Audio, Vehicles, Cars, and then pull star 1. Then go to here and click on Octane Data. And because we're going to be changing the exhaust sound, double click on this, go to here, and copy and paste the chunk for it, then go to Chunk Res Exporter, and then paste it in here. Then once you see it, right click, and go to Import, and then locate your new .chunk file that you just saved in Documents, and now it's in. Now the last part is going to the .chunk file that you had just made in Documents, and right click, go to Properties, and then copy and paste the file size of the chunk, and paste it in here, and remove the comma. This is to ensure the engine sound works, because if you do not do this, it will not work. And that's it. Now just save your project or export your mod for Frosty Mod Manager, and your car should sound just like the .chunk file, well technically the .gin file, that you just imported. <laughs> Now, you can do this for the engine layer as well, if you want to. And, if you want to get more sophisticated with your engine sounds, go to Polestar, the main folder, and then go to the Engine Exhaust tab, and then go to Parameters, and just go through all these folders until you find numbers between 1,000 and 8,000, and the higher number will be the maximum pitch that it will go to. If you want to raise the pitch of your engine sound, just make it a number higher than the number that it's at, and then this is the minimum. This is basically just the engine sound pitch range. Like if you want it to sound cooler. Well, have fun! Once again, this is Devin Millar, and I'll talk to you all later.